up YouTube Tony here with another video this is car blog number 44 and I was debating between the Exxon 7 versus the OnePlus 3 which one did I like better as far as overall experience and performance and obviously there was only one clear winner and I'm not gonna say which one it was really because you know I don't want to hurt nobody's feelings but yeah it was a clear winner so out of both devices one of them had to go the loser is no longer with me in my opinion it's not really a loser because it is a good device that would be the Exxon 7 it's a very good device performance wise the OnePlus 3 definitely it just feels a little bit well it feels a whole lot smoother and just the overall experience with the software and what else the software and the cameras were better oxygen os just is an all-around better than my f my favorite 4.0 or whatever that we're calling it i just didn't like that even even though i installed a Pix pixel launcher it's still it, it still lagged here and there and the cameras were not that good i think the cameras on the one plus three is actually way better in my opinion even though 20 megapixels you know more pixels than than the one plus three the camera department it was just not a better camera i think i was getting i know i was getting better photos with the one plus three so yeah i decided to sell that device and i have another device that's coming in i still have my iphone 7 which is my daily driver i've been using that also that's what i'm recording this this video with so iphone 7 definitely a great phone it's not the most customizable phone so if you're if you're on android and you like to customize and maybe ios just ain't for you I've always been on iOS. If you watch my previous videos, I've been on iOS since I think the first iPhone came out on and off. I just use it as my daily driver because it seems to work well with my MacBook. I get all my SMS messages that are sent to my iPhone. Even if they're not iMessages, I still get them on my MacBook. So that's a cool feature. And it, all, it also pairs up really nice with my LG G Watch R. So maybe like a year ago I was messing with the iphone connecting android wear to it and it just wasn't working as good as it is now actually android wear works pretty good on ios i'm getting all my i messages sms messages gmail emails pop up um yeah so far it's been great so definitely real nice the messages are really fast on ios as far as iMessage goes and also facetime is just real good on ios it doesn't um android what is it google dual doesn't compare to facetime facetime is just a lot smoother it just works a lot better in my experience so iphone 7 plus i'm definitely keeping that one plus three i'm definitely keeping this and i do have a new device that's coming on the way i'm not going to give it away stay tuned um i've been real busy this weekend so i don't have a lot of videos to put up i've been doing dishwasher i just installed the dishwasher some you know some home projects and my water tank went out so I had to replace my water tank yesterday so it wasn't too difficult but I had help so that's why I haven't been putting out I didn't even put out any videos yesterday so I'm doing some home renovations here and there I do have to do some kitchen flooring so I'll be doing that next and right now I'm in the parking lot to Gateway Animal Clinic in Ohio so my dog's doing real good by the way she's walking doing fine I'm just here to pick up some kind of shampoo and some kind of vitamins or something for my dog so yeah that's about it for this video i hope to make some more videos before the weekend is over and i'll catch you guys in the next one don't forget to like comment and subscribe and remember always to stay positive peace out